guys welcome back to my channel happy saturday i decided to turn on my camera to do hold your breath because y'all know i ain't did this in a while a vlog can y'all believe it i decided to vlog with y'all today and so as you can see i am still in my pjs um i am about to get in the shower and i need to make up my bed as y'all can see child it's let me show y'all my room right now because i really need to get it together so this is all of my stuff for you babies for this is my inventory thing it's two drawers put together Okay, and then I have clothes, clean clothes, stuff that I've tried on or posted pictures for. Y'all see two mannequin heads and a wig over there. That needs to be cleaned up. My bed needs to be cleaned up. A whole hot mess, okay? A hot mess right now. And if y'all can see, I've changed my wall up. I mean, this. Y'all, the reason why I'm not really, like, have my stuff like how I really want it is because I know that I will be moving from my mother's um, pretty soon. So, this is just all a temporary setup. I did kind of reorganize my makeup beauty counter, if y'all can see. Y'all see my new ring light I got. And then my lights over there, jewelry hanging up. Um, so my space is kind of pretty much cramped. This is a full 360 tour of my room. Y'all, it looks a mess. I got <laughs> dirty clothes right there. Um, my TV, my vision board. And then behind my door, I have more stuff, which is my flower wall that I created. I'm going to get me a bigger mirror. I have a new bulletin board that I have yet to put up. You see my other tripod. Um, clothes that I've either taken pictures in already or haven't taken pictures in yet. Um, if you follow me on Instagram, <laughs> the green and white outfit and the army fatigue outfit should look familiar. I have some more pictures for next week and i just got a package from fashion nova so let me kind of give y'all the whole overview of my room but again it is a mess right now i have packages on the floor for business stuff y'all i'm gonna start a entrepreneurial vlog series for being a lady boss so yeah that's what we're doing right now y'all it's um it's a lot that i need to do i will give y'all a tour of my bathroom right now but that needs to be cleaned too so yeah and actually our living room <laughs> looks a mess so i'm not even going to go there with y'all um so yeah so i'm about to take my medicine and get in the shower and when i come back um yeah i guess i will have my life somewhat together so i'll see y'all in a bit when i get it together hey y'all so it is saturday i hope y'all can see me I don't know if y'all can or not. I'm in a van with my mother. And we are at Menards. Um, I gotta go do some errands, go to Dollar General to try to stock up on some house stuff. And she's getting some water out of Menards. Um, I am looking crazy right now. But I know this vlog is like everywhere. <laughs> Y'all, I know this vlog is like everywhere. 
and I have on just leggings and a tank top and my sunglasses and if y'all are wondering yes I do have my mask um so yeah this vlog is gonna be kind of everywhere y'all so I've been trying to just get content out um doing stuff for my business um, I'm going to um, like I said y'all should be on the lookout for some more content and everything it's just this vlog is kind of everywhere and I usually don't really film with my mom because she doesn't like to be on camera but yeah maybe I can catch some of our conversations <laughs> and y'all I slept I took my makeup off last night and I my eyes are watering because my allergies have been kicking my butt y'all um oh yeah so last time y'all seen me my hair wasn't done or it wasn't it didn't have blonde highlights I don't remember and I do have on lashes from my store. These are the Glam House Doll Lashes. Y'all, I probably still got residue of makeup because all I did was do my makeup wipes after um, I took some pictures yesterday. So you probably still see a little bit of makeup and I slept with my lashes. Oh, and these nails are by the Nail Junkie. These are called Periods. Period, so period. And these are the extra long um, nails that I got from the Nail Junkie. I will leave the link below. But if you follow me on Instagram, then you'll see that I shouted them out and they shouted me out. So shout out to y'all. Um, this is my second favorite custom press on nail company. So get into it, y'all. Get into it. Um, yeah, I know I'm kind of just everywhere. Like, because I don't really leave the house like that. Like, even, even I'm back on to my 9 to 5 job, and I told y'all that. So I work from home. I work from home so basically I work from home for everything for my corporate job and I know I probably really haven't told you guys this but I work for an insurance company and I do like the back end work um, I started off in doing just uh, back end billing um, but like I do the back end work so when you guys get letters um if you're needing to change your policy by adding hmm, excuse me y'all it's been a late morning and i just woke up really to be honest <laughs> y'all i love people watching side note just seeing the different people that is um coming into the store but anywho so like I was saying for my corporate job I work for an insurance company so I do a lot of back end work a lot of I still kind of do billing because I have to make sure that the payments posted um, verify that all the money you know is balanced um, I kind of do like the back back end stuff to where I'm making sure other people are doing their job posting the money that you guys send in for your premiums um, stuff like that so I do a lot of back end work so I'm on the computer for 8 hours a day um, more than that if we have overtime <sighs> and right now I am easing my way back into y'all it's hot I had to 
to open up my mom's window like it's hot. <laughs> it's hot in these streets right now. So yeah, I'm at Avon. If you guys are in Indiana, if you guys are in Indianapolis, I'm in the Avon area. Um, because I live out in Hendricks County. So you know the surrounding little sub cities. Um and so yeah, we at the Menards out this way. Avon on a Saturday, y'all. It be so many people out. So many people. But yeah. I'm just chilling. I hope you get babies are doing good, having a good Saturday. Um, I'll probably get some more footage once I go in Dollar General. Hello. Hi, this summer? Yes, this is her. Hey, Summer, it's Nick with the IT service. I was just giving you a call back. Okay. Uh, you mind if I take control of this? Yes, go ahead. How's your day going? It's going pretty good. I already good. asked you that. You can't, you can't get your work done. I already asked you that. Jeez. <laughs> Sorry, when I called you back, it felt like just like a new call right there. So I'm just like reverting back to my, you know, like let's flow with it. Let's ask how they're doing kind of vibe and all that kind of stuff. So. Understood. <laughs> Listen, look, I, I don't like to be bored on these calls. Like I know there are some people you might call and you might talk to and it's just pure silence. Yes, it does be like this sometimes. <laughs> I, I, I can't stand it. I can't stand it. I'm always talking. Even when I call help, like, 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 let's say I have to call Sprint for my phone. I'm, I'm talking their ear off. They just know I'm the, that's just my personality. <laughs> I love it because it does get boring. you like, oh, I just have to sit here and press this, do this. <laughs> I'm 
relaxing it now. Perfect, thank you. I think everybody's stuff is acting up because I know I was jabbering and um, t uh, sending messages on team to my supervisor and she said my screen keeps freezing up <laughs> so I don't know she was like call IT okay it's asking for the session key alright it's going to be 138 Okay, it's asking for the session key. All right, I got Bomber loaded in now. Uh, session key is going to be 145. 
stuff, how fast you can do stuff. But at the end of the day, I think resolving the issue and spending enough time to make sure you don't send a ticket and then you know the customer is satisfied as well, I think that's also important. Yeah. Well, good thing I don't, I mean, I have sets, but, like, I'm not on any phones, so I do back-end work. So, yeah. <laughs> I'm not really stuck to a time limit like that. Yeah, I don't really have a, and so I say time, like time, I, I don't have a time limit either, but obviously the faster things are solved, the better. Yeah. Um, in, the, in their eyes, so, um, but you know, I know it takes five, five or ten, actually ten minutes to make sure you're all taken care of, so. Hopefully this will just take me right on up until my lunch time. I'm curious how many people are still, are you in the office or out of the office? Out of the office. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm still working from home. Yeah, I started this position back on March 16th. I was in the office for training for two days and then I was sent home with my laptop, so I don't even know where my desk is. Oh, wow. <laughs> I don't even know if I'm going to get one. Well, yeah. And I just say, just, just you, you guys are all working from home. <laughs> yep, I'll probably be working from home for a while. I just got back to work and it was like, from leave, and it was like, oh, um, We've moved areas since you were at work last, but you won't be at work anyway. I'm just like, okay. <laughs> so, I don't right. even know where my new desk area is if I did have to go into the office. <laughs> it was like... Pretty easy times. They was like, come get your stuff. You'll be working from home. I'm like, okay, that works for me. <laughs>
start work at 7. So, I want to say, and that's Eastern time. So, I want to say it started um, happening around 9 a.m. this morning. Yes. So I started troubleshooting once it started, and um, it's like eleven thirty four a.m. Eastern time. So I have been working with this since then, trying to do a complete shutdown or restart of the computer. All of this stuff. Do you need to save any work that's open right now for a reboot? Nope. Okay. Just so you do know, just so you don't waste your time in the future because your time is valuable and important, uh, shut down. If you do the shutdown option, it literally does nothing. So you don't want to do it. It uh, Restarts are the best. Um, so if you're going to do anything, just do a restart. You don't need to shut down, just so you know, okay? Okay. Shut down kind of for whatever reason puts processes and applications to sleep, um, which is why if you shut your computer down at the end of every workday, the issue might persist the next day to where if you do a complete, re if you do a restart, that should end the processes, therefore um, fix it. That's why restarts, you know, when you call the IT desk, depending on what the issue is, you know, I go, did, they, did you restart yet? And you go, no. Nope. And they go, okay, let's start there because that should end a lot of processes. So, oh, okay. just so you know. Okay. Not saying you did anything wrong. Uh, but when did Outlook work last? I'm assuming at the end of your shift yesterday. Yeah, and I just locked my computer. Um, but again, like I said, it was like an hour after I got off of work. It started storming really bad. <laughs> And then, so, the power glitched at first, and then it just completely went out for, like, several hours last night. Got it. What, what time did your shift end yesterday, or would you say you know how it last worked? Uh, my shift ended at 3.30 p.m. Eastern time yesterday, so I had locked my computer, and I hadn't went, I hadn't logged back in until this morning so i would say 3 3 30 okay. p.m yesterday and you want me to go ahead and sign back in yes please Give me one moment here. I'm just going to mute my microphone. I need to sneeze. Okay. I muted my microphone. Your power may have gone out again. <laughs> it's loading. It's taking its sweet time. No worries. No rush on my side.
part of Indiana are you in? Indianapolis. Are you close to like Illinois? I'm in Indianapolis, Indiana. Just because I'm uh, geographically challenged or I just don't ever go to these other cities, is that close to the Illinois part? No, that's, uh, if I was further north, I would be closer to Illinois. So, like, I'm three hours away from Chicago. Okay. Yep. My in-laws live in Chicago, and I have an uncle who lives kind of, not right on the border. He's, like, um, 20 to 30 minutes into Indiana across part of Indiana. <laughs> Got it. Yep. <laughs> I was due for a trip down in Indiana for my uncle, um, but, uh, you know, the whole COVID thing. Yeah. Yeah, that is uh, <laughs> putting everybody's plans on hold or what have you. Okay, so it has the live chat thing up. From yeah, Bunga. it's uh, waiting. Once the VPN reconnects, I should be able to uh, be back into your computer. Okay. Slowly working. I'll be so glad when I get sent a laptop. <laughs> yeah. connect on my end. No worries. Looks like it's finally connecting. Yep. <laughs> 